everything you do in Nigeria is a problem. What will you do to be happy? What will you do to please people in Nigeria? Welcome to my channel. If it is your first time of stopping by, you are highly welcome. Please, I beg you for a favor. Click on that red button that says subscribe. Beside it is a notification bell. Turn it on so that you will be getting updates from me anytime I upload a new video. So the young man you are seeing here is MC Tawaye. MC Tawaye. He is a comedian that is always mimicking our president, Muhammad Buhari. So even before, whenever he dresses like Buhari, I find it difficult to, you know, differentiate. At times, I think that he is the real Buhari. Now he has been getting that uh, threat that he should stop imitating or mimicking Buhari. If not, his life will be in danger. I will allow you to listen to him as he explain everything that goes on. I just wanted to explain to you or analyze to you what is going on. You can listen to him after listening. Please, I would like you to drop your comment or what you think about what they are telling him. Thank you so much. Hello, everyone. Good morning. Um, yeah, I know a lot of people feel... Uh, I'm, I'm like this today. Uh, I usually don't do videos like this, but uh, it has become necessary that I do it. Um, a lot has taken place three weeks, two weeks ago. Um, Especially on the issue of NSAS, um, a lot of people are, are talking, comments from every angle, from everywhere. Like I said earlier on my page, that before a lot of youths took to the streets to protest about NSAS. I had already released two videos with my craft. Now, um, mimicking the president is something I've been doing for like uh, four to five years now. And um, I also want to call the attention of a lot of people who do not understand or probably do not know um, I have been a fan of the president for years before he became the president Uh, probably you got to know when I was mimicking him, okay? Uh, mimicking the president is a talent. Like I said in several interviews I had, I mimic a lot of people. And, um, but that of the president uh, went viral and probably, and of course, uh, brought me to limelight. As a result, I have, or probably, I had a lot of criticism, a lot of insult, a lot of threats from people who feel they have problem with the president from people who feel they don't like the president uh, in other words i share his criticism and i share his um, uh, do i see dislikes yeah so
Talking about answers. Not only me, even the government have acknowledged that the answers protesters are actually on a good course. Everybody knows that. Nobody in his right senses will support officials of the government who are supposed to protect the people end up killing the people. It is unacceptable. And their voice were heard by a lot of Nigerians and by the government. And government made a commitment to it. So many people said, why not go to the streets and join other celebrities to show solidarity and all of that. I don't do things to please anybody. I don't do things that I'm not comfortable with just to make somebody comfortable. I don't do that. Anybody that knows me will say this. I don't do it. I do things I, I understand and can defend. I meet the president, like I said, and that makes me like a lot of people believe I am part of the government. Mimicking the president is not an office. Mimicking the president is not a portfolio. Okay? That I'm mimicking the president does not make me part of his cabinet. No. I maintain I'm still a comedian. Okay? Probably a lot of you do not like the way I mimic the president, the light in which I mimic the president. I always, all my videos are towards the direction of promoting the president, promoting the person of the president. What many out there would want me to do is what this guy who mimics Donald Trump does. Rubbish him, make him look stupid, insult him and all of that. I can't do that. Okay? I can't do that. So if you are threatening my life and that of my family because I don't rubbish the president, uh, whatever I say is in support of the president, let me ask you a question. I am mimicking somebody. When you are mimicking somebody, you are that person. Will you do contrary to what that person is doing? I don't understand. Will you do contrary to what that person is doing? If I'm mimicking somebody, whenever I'm in character, I'm that person. And it is expected I behave, act like that person when I'm in character. So if these are the basis of your threat. Well, I'm sorry, I can't help you. Very sorry, I cannot help you. There's a group of um, Igbos in the diaspora called obi -Wanne. They sent threats through one of their members that they should take care of myself and my twin brother that are supporting Buhari and all of that. It is unfortunate, it is unfortunate that among all the problems of this country, you stoop so low 
to make me your problem. It is sad. So your message is well delivered and well received. I will take appropriate actions. Of course, I'm a law abiding citizen and in that light, I'm going to take appropriate action. I do not have problem with anybody. I have a right just like you and every other Nigerian. But at the point where your own right is trying to stop my own right, then there's a problem. There's a serious problem. So I want the world to know, I want all Nigerians to know that have been threatened by this so-called group will be one day in the diaspora. A lot of people feel they are not in the country, they are outside the country, and so they can do whatever they want, they can say whatever they want, they can instigate people to create violence that leads to, uh, you know, a uh, loss of properties and lives. Because you are not in Nigeria, you feel nobody can arrest you. The security agency cannot, you know, do anything because you are not in Nigeria. And probably some of them hide under fake accounts to be making these threats. But on this particular note, I am going to take necessary action. Because I see no reason why, because I mimic the president. And so you have issues with the president and you are coming to me. To some people who I think are just unbelievable said I'm the one making the speeches the president is making are you okay that I'm the one in Aso Rock that I, I, I am the one they are using to hide the president is dead that I'm the one they are using to hide it I mean I don't understand there's a saying in Hausa, Imme Magana, Wawani, Shime Sararamba. If somebody who makes a statement is stupid and foolish, what about you that is listening? Can't you reason? Can't you reason, for God's sake? I'm not your problem. Okay? I'm not your problem. If you think I'm your problem, then you have a problem, a serious problem. Whatever I do, I promote this country. Whatever I do, I promote the unity of this country, which I so much believe in. If you think otherwise, it's your opinion, not mine. It's your right to have that opinion. It's also my right to have that opinion. So I've, I've had or probably received your threat. Thank you. And I will take appropriate actions, like I've said. I'll follow the right channels to make this very well known. And to so many people sending DMs to me, threatening my life, that they will attack me and all of that. Anywhere they see me, they should attack me, they should kill me, they should do this, they should do that, and all of that. I have all those DMs, I have all those comments. Munched and kept. Okay? So, I, I have to stop here for now. Thank you and um, do have a lovely day. This is Linda TV Show. The home of news. Welcome to my channel. If this is your first time or first day of coming across my YouTube channel or seeing my face, you are highly welcome. Hey, please be coming to my next channel. My name is Linda Chukwezi. It comes as Miguel. That red button that says subscribe and you turn on the notification bell so that you'll be able 
to get information on the Bis zum nächsten Video und einen schönen Tag. Tschüss. Tschüss. Bis mein subscribe to Linda's TV show. What are you waiting for? Click on that red button that says subscribe. You turn on the notification bell so that you'll be getting more updates from me. Leave your comments down below and share this video with your friends, families, and colleagues until we meet again in my next video. Bye-bye.